Hi, I'm Laura Bartow from Studio One Stampers, and I have a delightful class for you. This one is called Birthday Surprise. I have created eight different cards that all have surprises. Some of them pop out, some of them have movements, some of them have surprises inside or on the outside. It's just a delightful combination of really fun cards to make and even more fun, fun to, to send and to display because these cards are the cards that are a little gift in a package. You'll have so much fun making them. I've used just two stamp sets that you would need to have to make these at home. I've got the Best Day and the Taco Fiesta. This has been so much fun. And then all kinds of fun ways to color these things. Um, you're gonna have so much fun. We've got pop-ups and inside folds and fun folds and um, just all kinds of great things. And I can't wait to show you how each of these cards works. So let's go take a closer look and see how each of these cards work. Well, I've just fallen in love with this Best Day stamp set. If you look at it, it's just amazing. It's got these cute little images that are just so fun to color, and then four different greetings that you can mix and match throughout your projects. I've used all of them in this class, and even for um, lots of other things as well. So here is our first card. This is a pop-up card, and you can see it's got a great little message inside. You can see it's got its own little... Um, message popping right up and this adorable little um, kitty inside of the, the cupcake wrapper. And I've used my um, watercolor two assortment pencils and water painters to get this cute little watercolor look for that. Well, let's look at our next one. Oh, and I also use the um, uh, Enjoy the Journey Designer Series paper. That's the paper that's right here. So that's what you've got right here for these nice, bright, fun colors. Well, let's talk about our next card. Our next card is a um, another pop-up card. So it opens like this, and then it opens here with another pop-up message for you. So you can see it's a double Dutch open card, and I've used, again, the watercolor pencils um, to use that. But this time I've used this gorgeous paper um, called Flowers and More, and I've used that for the next few cards as well. This is a host item. It's only available with Stampin' Rewards. So once you get to a um, an order of $150, this is what you can purchase with your free rewards dollars that you get. So you can put orders together with friends. You can um, do it yourself, however you want to get there. But oh my goodness, what an amazing collection there. So so here's our next card and this one uses of course this same paper and you can see I've made candles out of this paper and then this one opens up and it actually stands up in this position. Can you see the beautiful layers and all the 3D look? It just stands right up and we've used that cake image again as well. And look at the gorgeous papers and how they all go together. Um, I've used a few other little papers to go in there as well, but look at that, that is so much fun. And then let's talk about our last card. Here's our last card that I wanted to bring in. And this uses the greetings again and uses our frames, our, um, our fabulous frames dies as well as our little daisy punch um, to do that so that one opens this way and then the pops open with these cute little um, uh, sparklers at the bottom so just a great little fun happy card well let's look at the rest of the collection using our taco fiesta stamp set well, this next set of cards uses this adorable set called Taco Fiesta. It's got 23 stamps in it, all photopolymer, super easy to use, and give you tons and tons of coloring options. I especially love all these little faces that you can add to all of the tacos and um, burritos and all sorts of things. And it's got puns in there. Holy guacamole, it's your birthday, or your nacho average friend, which is so fun to have all these cute little sayings. Well, I think we've made some great cards using them. So here's this one, and this one is actually um, a pop-up card, and look at this, it opens up 
to a little pinata party. Can you see how the pinata just sort of hangs in there for a little happy birthday? This is actually three dimensional and so it um, has all these different layers and that's using these great dies here. Um, these are called, what are these called? These are called the layering diorama dies. And so I actually use those to create these openings in here um, to do that. So isn't that fun? So that's one card. And then our next card here is using that same little pinata, but it does a little pop-up. And so when you open it, it actually opens up into the middle. So it actually stands there as a little presentation. Isn't that just so fun? And we've got a little bit of fringe on the bottom here as well. And of course, the tutorial tells you all the dimensions, how to make all of these um, great little pop-up cards. Um, just great instruction. So I hope that you'll um, enjoy taking this class and enjoy the, um, the tutorial that comes with this. Now here's another card and this one is um, a, just a fun card. It is, it says you spice up my life and then you get to choose your peppers and peppers come in all the different colors. Isn't that just so delightful? And then of course when you open it up we've got singing cactuses because of course why wouldn't you have singing cactuses um, inside with sombreros on? I just think that's so much fun. Just a delight to have this. Um, and that of course uses our um, our dies that um, that I think it's called um, something a whirl anyway and then here's our last one holy guacamole it's your birthday and this one stands up um, so it's got that 3d look to it and then it has a cute little message inside that says you're not your average friend and how cute is that lots of coloring um, for some of the cards I've used the Stampin blends so I've got that on um, what I've used for the earlier cards and then the rest of the cards I used to use my Stampin write markers um, all kinds of different colors and I do want to let you know that you want to make certain that you grab any colors um, from our in colors that are retiring this year so be sure to grab um, any of those colors that you need um, before everything is gone at the end of April anyway here we are that's our collection of these delightful surprise birthday cards